In this video, we will take a look at finding the age of people when we're given the sum of their ages right now. To set this up, let's consider if we are told right now the sum of two individuals is 8. Let's say the first person is 3 years old. The second person, we could quickly calculate by taking the total, or 8, minus 3. Similarly, when we don't know the first person, we end up with a subtraction problem right now. Again, if they have a total of 8, and the first person is x, the second person becomes the subtraction problem, total, or 8, minus x. We find when we have the sum now, for the first box, we will use x. And the second box, we will always use total, minus x. Let's take a look at some examples where we can see this play out. In this first problem, we see that we are comparing the ages of a man and his son. Right now, we're told the sum of their ages is 82 years. We don't know how old the man is, so we make that x. The son becomes the subtraction problem, 82 minus x. The next column, we fill in by the change in time, 11 years ago. Subtracting 11 from each cell gives us x minus 11, and 82 minus 11 is 71 minus x. We use the rest of the problem to make our equation. The man was, or equals, twice his son's age, 2 times the son. We then can replace the m with what he was in the past, x minus 11. Similarly, we get 2 times the son, who in the past was 71 minus x. This gives us an equation we can quickly solve for x. Start by distributing the 2 to get x minus 11 equals 142 minus 2x. Finally, get the variable to one side by adding 2x to both. 3x minus 11 equals 142. Adding 11 to both sides gives us 3x equals 153. Dividing both sides by 3 will give us x equals 51. The man, or x, is 51. To find the son, we simply do 82 minus the 51, and we get 31. The man is 51, the son is 31. Let's try another example where we can see this total time. In this problem, we see that we're comparing the ages of a woman and her daughter. Right now, the sum is 38. We make the woman x and the daughter the total, or 38, minus x. Here, the change in time is 9 years. We're adding 9 years into the future. This gives us x plus 9, and 47 minus x. Next, we make an equation for the future. The woman will be triple her daughter's age, 3 times her daughter's age. Replacing the woman with her future value, x plus 9, equals 3d, the daughter, 47 minus x. We can solve this equation by distributing x plus 9 equals 141 minus 3x, Moving the variable to one side by adding 3x, 4x plus 9 equals 141. Subtracting 9 from both sides, 4x equals 132. And finally, dividing both sides by 4. x is equal to 33. x, or the woman, is 33. The daughter is 38 minus 33, or 5. The woman is 33, the daughter is 5. 